I'm getting like heat rashes. This is currently how the process is going. I'm unwell. What is this called? My brain is not working today. Ta da! Ever since I bought it, I've been just like writing this around my house. Ah! Hey, cat cakes! Welcome back to my channel! Yay! Okay, so for today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys everything I do to prepare for a long travel journey ahead of me. Me and my sisters are traveling to Korea and Japan for a total of 21 days, I think. And I'm a little bit nervous because it's the longest time I've ever been out of town for. So I really, really need to make sure that I have everything I need and that I have everything prepared. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, first things first on my list, I need to take Chai to the groomers. She's a little bit of a fluff ball right now and I want to make sure that she's clean because my boyfriend will be taking care of her while I'm gone and I don't want him to deal with her when she's a little stinky. So I have to run to the groomers right now and I'll catch you guys in a bit. Say hi to the camera. Say hi. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm back from getting my coochie waxed and also Chai is back from getting groomed. Oh, she's really shy of her haircut right now because it doesn't look the best. I asked for a summer shortcut and it is short. Chai, come on, show yourself. It's okay, there's nothing to be embarrassed of. She's really embarrassed of her haircut right now. Come here, Chai. Don't you want to show the cat kicks your haircut? Chai, heel? Heel? Good girl. When I say heel, she comes right through. Oh. Oh, Chai, show them your haircut. Oh, you look so naked. Look at this. Honey, it's okay. I think I still think you look beautiful. Mwah. Well, this shortcut will keep her cool throughout the summer. It's super hot in New York these days, so I asked for her hair to be super short. And even if it's a little not cute, it'll feel good for her, so. Mmm, she smells so good too. Anyways, we both got groomed. Mommy's shaved under there and you're also shaved everywhere. Oh, that kind of rhymed. I have some laundry that is long overdue, so I'm going to quickly do that now and then get started on packing. Okay, so for my suitcases, I'm going to be bringing one large carry-on. This is from Ramoa, and apparently this fits like 21 outfits. This is the one Blackpink has for their concerts, and I got really curious and bought it off of Amazon. I was really contemplating if this is worth it or not, and I think it's worth it. Oh my god, I can't wait for you guys to see this. This is like a super epic moment. Ready, guys? <laughs> Do you guys see that? And it's a little scooter! Oh my god! So I'll be bringing this with me to Korea. The airport in Korea is like super super big. So I feel like this is so worth it. Guys look, I can go forward, then go backwards, and then go forward, and then there's a break. Isn't this genius? Ever since I bought it, I've been just like writing this around my house. I didn't see you there. All right, I'm going. Bye. Yeah. Hi, sorry. Yeah. Oh my god, I am so embarrassed. My neighbor just walked on me scootering around my hallway. So that's really, really great. That's so embarrassing. Okay, breather, breather. Okay, let's get started packing because just wasted my time scootering around. Um, 
So yeah, my face is like so red from being so embarrassed at my neighbors walking in on me, scootering my luggage. They probably think I'm insane. I don't, I honestly don't know where to start because there's just so many things that I need to pack, but I think I'm gonna get started on packing my outfits and all my clothes that I have in my closet. While we are on the topic of clothes, I just wanna thank ThreadUp for sponsoring this portion of the video. Yay! This back to school season, I wanna encourage all of you guys to give up fast fashion, and that is why I partnered with ThreadUp to launch a shop that makes it easy for you guys to thrift my looks. I picked out so many cute gems here from ThreadUp, and I wanna show you guys my favorite picks. This shirt is one of them I think it's so cute I would obviously for back to school I would wear a cardigan over it I always find the best hidden gems at thread up for such a great price I found this really cute black cardigan it has this little fabric in the front that makes it just look so classy and elegant and I just know I will wear this so often the quality is great and the brand is Charles Cheng Lima love it so much next I picked out this really cute red cardigan and it has a little knot in the front. This is just such a cute red accent for my outfits. Next, I picked out this really, really cute black dress. This is from Free People. It has these cute little patterns. I love how flowy and girly and cutesy this is. I highly encourage you guys to check out this back to school shop at my link below and use my code here for an extra 40% off your first order. Thank you, ThreadUp, and let's get back to packing for Korea. I'm gonna decide which outfits I wanna to take to Korea and I'll catch you guys in a bit. This is currently how the process is going. I'm unwell. I feel like I'm going insane. I'm getting like heat rashes. I'm sweating so much and I... <laughs> I finally have all my outfits set. I'm probably insane for doing this, but I basically took mirror selfies of all my outfits and then I put it all in my notes. So it looks like this. So yeah, that took a total of three hours. I don't know what was in my chai latte today, but my room, by the way, I don't even want to talk about it. Just, oh my God, chai's just been chilling on my bed. She's probably judging the F out of me. And then I have all my clothes that is not organized yet. So now it's time for me to put this all in a luggage. <laughs> I bought this clothing organizer from Amazon. I've been seeing a lot of people use the travel organizer, so I want to give it a try. I'm going to try to see how many pants I can fit into this one. Oh, she knows I'm about to leave. I'm sorry, baby. I'm going to miss you so much. I got all my pants in here. In the next one, I'm gonna put in all my dresses, skirts, and see how much space I have. Now the t-shirts and all the shirts, I'm gonna fit into this one. All right, and then I'm gonna bring four pairs of shoes. One is gonna be this one. And then I'm bringing these just brown sandals. And then I'm gonna wear these sneakers. I'm gonna bring this one. Those are my shoes. And now I'm gonna pack all my bras and panties. Oh, I've been getting a lot of questions of what bra I wear for my backless shirts and strapless shirts and I wear this, this is the brand from Amazon. It's basically like a sticky bra and it has a little bit of support so I find these great and I bought another one in case I lost this because this is like my holy grail. I'm gonna be packing this extra one as well. Okay 
guys, I'm actually done with all my clothes. I have more space in this area, so this is where I'm gonna put all my toiletries and all my makeup products in here. But before we get to do that, I made a list of things that I'm missing. I need to go run to Target to get fabric softener, elastic bands, tiny black hairpins, and a stain remover, because I think those four are essential when you're traveling. So yeah, I'm gonna run to Target and get some right now. <laughs> Why do you look like that? Come here. Okay, I just came back from Target. I picked up a bunch of things that I didn't even knew existed, like this little mini lint roller. This I totally need, and I love how it's small so that I can just fit it in my purse. For sure, I'm gonna need that. I brought vitamin C. I'm going to take vitamin C every single day so that I don't get sick. I got this first aid kit, which I know will be of use someday. And then I got fabric scent in case my clothes smell. You know, there's a lot of chances my clothes can smell. Wrinkles release, which I obviously need. And then I got hand sanitizer. And then I got tons. Um, the only thing I was not- <gasps> Budge! I forgot to get elastic bands. I'm gonna text Erica and Emily to bring them. Can you guys bring elastic bands? This is why having sisters are great. Okay, let's start packing all of this up. I have a lot of pouches. I have- Oof! Did you see all that dust? I have one. There's so many dusts everywhere. This was like under my sink and I just pulled it out. I have one, two, three, four, and five. Hopefully I don't need to use all of these. Okay, first things first, I'm gonna pack a bunch of floss. If I don't floss in a day, my mouth just feels disgusting. So I'm gonna pack a bunch of these into like this little, this has like a lot of side pockets in here, which is great. So I just like put them all in there. So this is the bag where I put all my big face stuff. I'm bringing this makeup remover from Tatcha and I highly recommend this for anyone who has dry skin. This just moisturize my skin as I take my makeup off. So it's great. And then I'm bringing my little tretinoin cream that I always have to use every night. Then my metro gel. I'm gonna pack this, but I need to charge it. So I'm gonna charge it later. Bringing this gel. I'm also gonna bring my own shampoo this time. I find that when I use hotel shampoos, my scalp just breaks out and I don't feel good about it. So styling treatment, body oil. This is actually from Osea. I don't know how to pronounce this, but I put it in the small bottle so that I don't have to bring this one around. I'm gonna bring this hair oil. I don't have a smaller thing for this, so I'm just gonna bring this whole thing. I'm bringing this face cream. I'm bringing this other face cream, just in case. I'm bringing this serum. It's really good for dry skin. I'm bringing this other serum. I really hope that this doesn't explode. That's gonna go in my bag. All right, this is all I need for my skincare. Oh, there's so much dust everywhere. <laughs> Ugh. All right, next I'm gonna be using this makeup bag. This is where I'm gonna put all my makeup inside, so that's gonna be fun. I'm bringing this mattifying primer from Smashbox. We're going during rain season again, so I wanna make sure my face doesn't come off looking like a grease ball. I'm in a dilemma because I don't know which foundation I'm into these days. I'm usually just using a concealer, but I don't know if I should bring a foundation or what? Should I just bring one? Okay, I'm just gonna bring this Lancome foundation along with these concealers, eye palette. I'm gonna try to bring as little makeup as possible so that I can buy more in Korea, you know what I mean? Oh my God, guys, guess what I found? A mini cushion. This is literally the cutest thing ever. Look at that, isn't that insane? This is the original and this is the small version. It's so cute. I literally can't. This is so perfect because I can just put this in my purse everywhere. So I'm definitely gonna bring this. I'm gonna make sure that I have these two pins for when I take my makeup off. Oh, I just found my elastic bands. Highlighter. I'm gonna bring my, what is this called? My brain is not working today. Powder. Like, how did I forget that? Powder, and I'm also gonna bring a different type of powder. Powder is gonna be my best friend for this trip. Three brushes. I have this little brush bag. I don't know what this is. 
and I'm just gonna stick everything in here. Lips, I'm gonna bring this, a gloss. I honestly have like 20 different lips in my bag, so I'm just gonna bring these for now. Two done. All right, what else do I need? In this beige bag, I'm gonna put all my necessities, like my first aid kit. Let's see what is in here. There's hand cleansing wipe, band-aid, and a gauze. Honestly, I'm probably not gonna use this, but I'm still gonna bring it just in case. I hate that feeling where I just leave it and then during the trip, I'm like, oh, I should have brought it. I hate feeling that, so I'm gonna just bring everything. I'm also gonna bring my propolis and probiotics and sticking that in here. Stuff. Okay. Okay, guys, this is how my room is looking right now. I laid out everything that I need on this bed. I will be bringing this huge bag that I always bring when I'm traveling. And here I'm gonna put my laptop, a small makeup bag, my passport case, card holder, perfume, eye drops, and chapstick. I'm gonna put that in here. My sunglasses, my Canon camera, and I got a little mini purse for it so it doesn't get damaged. And I'm also gonna be bringing this little pouch which I'm gonna put in my camera chargers and I also have my other camera. This one is the GR Ricco camera and I think I mentioned this to you guys before but I love this. It takes really nice pictures. So I'm definitely gonna be bringing this one. And then I have a bag with all my electronic chargers and wire stuff all goes in here. And I love that it's see-through so that I could just grab them all. For the big pouches over here, I'm gonna put those in my luggage. This space is pretty much full, so I cannot put any more stuff inside of here, but I have a teeny tiny bit of space over here, and this is where I'm gonna put all my extra things that I cannot fit. So I'm gonna bring this little handbag, and this is the only little handbag that I'm gonna be bringing other than this little tote bag. So these two are gonna be in there. I'm also gonna put this pouch, my makeup pouch, and my toiletry pouch in here. So I hope that this fits. And I'm also gonna be bringing these three hats. The Celine hat that I got gifted, really wide hat that I feel like I'm gonna be using a lot, and a basic baseball cap. I also packed my mini straightener in here, and that's pretty much it, guys. OMG. I can't believe I finished packing. Now I'm gonna see if my luggage even closes. Ready, guys? Eek! Yay! It's all packed! Woo! Surprisingly, I have a bit of room still. So that means this trunk is like humongous. I'm so proud of myself. I finally finished packing. The only thing that I need to pack is this little carry-on, but this has like no space at all because this is honestly not even a carry-on. This is just a, basically a scooter with a little bit of a pocket next to it. This is all that it fits. And in here, I'm gonna put my big camera that I use for vlogging and all my tripods. So this little carry-on bag will just be for my camera accessories. And that's pretty much it. <sighs> I thought this would take just a couple hours, like two hours or something. No, it took five hours, but I'm finally done. Yay! And I leave for Korea in less than 48 hours. So I'll see you guys in Korea. I hope this video was of some help for those that are also traveling as well this summer. Packing is definitely not easy, so I definitely recommend you guys to start at least a day or two before your actual travel date. You never know what's gonna happen, you know what I mean? Anyways, thanks for watching this video. I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys in Korea. And also, thanks for ThreadUp for sponsoring this video. Make sure to check out my back to school shop at my link below and use my code Evelyn for an extra 40% off your first order. Anyways, I'll see you guys in Korea. Bye!